Before, it wasn't respect. Chicks would walk all over me. No cap. What's going on, guys? Thanks for tuning in for another video. I really appreciate it. Thanks for subscribing. I really appreciate it. Thanks for tuning in for the video. We on our road to 50. Let's go. On our road to 50. 50 of them thanks. 50 of them subscribers. And we strong. Let's go. Let's go. All right, as the sign of the video, this is how women been reacting to the red pill. This is how women have been reacting to the red pill. All right, now here's my status. I'm in monk mode. I'm doing semen retention, and I'm not dating. Not, all right? Strictly working in YouTube, semen retention. Monk mode, that's what we're doing, all right? All right, so here's what I think, what I've been experiencing, my experience. Attraction has been at an all-time high. I'm not even capping. Attraction has been at an all-time high. I'm not even capping. You know, and the reason why I say that is because red pill provides a look of indifference. Red pill provides a look of confidence that I've been having in comparison to previous times. So I look around, I have I left this look of confidence. The chick looks at you immediately, she could tell, oh man something about this guy he's probably on semen retention i don't know this guy i never met this guy never spoke a word for this guy but he looks like he's in monk mode i never even seen this guy before in my life but i know he's not dating it's attractive i haven't had this look the whole time when i first started and i was in red pill rage no chick was not looking my way i had this anger and this resentment with me. But now being a monk mode, this is pure right now. This is all energy. Let's go. Well, I think I've noticed it when I when I turned 205. When I turned 205, it got live. You know what I mean? I was like 196 when I first, when I turned 205, it got live. But disclaimer, I would say that the weight isn't everything. Because before, a long time ago, I was lifting I got nothing. So I think it's energy with the added up weight room and all of that. Red pill provide a look of indifference, confidence, therefore more attraction, I believe. Yeah. The next thing is respect. Respect. They respect you. They respect, they respect the hell out of me. And guess what? I ain't do a goddamn thing. I ain't doing nothing, but they respect the hell out of me. Why? Because I treat myself with respect. Plus, I'm on a red pill. I don't swallow the red pill, baby. They respect the hell out of you. Before, it wasn't respect. Chicks will walk all over me. No cap. Chicks will walk all over me, say what they want, slap me on the back of the head. Goofy motherfucker. Use a silly ass motherfucker. But now they respect me. You can see how they kept, they walking on eggshells around me. Oh, e oh, I don't, I need, I need, I mean to, uh, I need, I mean to, uh, are you, uh. Bitch, you know what it is. This is 130 days on semen retention right here. This is monk mode all year right here. The respect is there. They respect you. That's how the women been reacting. They've been respecting me. Respect. R-E-S-P-E-C. Hmm. Now, if you want to know if a woman respects you or not, don't take a look on what they say. Take a look on how they act. If she's like, That's good. The next thing is they get uncomfortable around you. And I'm not talking about a scared looking way. I'm talking about they don't know. They don't, they, you're unpredictable. They don't know what to get from you. One day is tomato, the other day is tomato. One day you eating 
some chips the other day. You messing with okra. You don't even know, you don't even eat the same things. You're doing different things. One day you you will cross the street, next day you right on front of their face like this. What's good? You know what I mean? They don't understand. They can't put their finger on your moves. You are not predictable. You know, when I was blue, when I'm back in the day, I was predictable. You get what I'm saying? They knew my every action. They could pinpoint everything. I was agreeable. I was buying snacks. I would go to the I would go to the store and buy them snacks. And if they didn't have the specific snacks, I would text them and be like, "Hey, you know they don't got the Doritos Cool Ranch. Would you like the Doritos Sweet Chili?" And they'd be like, "Get the fuck out of here, you bitch ass nigga." And they would say stuff like that. Well, they don't really say stuff like that, but you know what I'm saying? They'd be like, they knew what they was gonna get. Now that it's almost like they're on their best behavior, they're on their best behavior around you because they don't want to piss you off. I guess I don't know. They just I feel like a chick understand when a dude is high value and they just subconsciously they're aware of it. You know what I'm saying? They just don't. They just know that this guy should be treated with high value because he's gonna be successful. I don't know. I don't know what it is. They just know. They could look into your eyes. They'd be like, damn, this guy, this guy's on YouTube. But anyway, the last one is attention. Attention, that's the last one. People, girls that value your attention more on Red Pill because they don't really, you don't really give your attention out like that. So when you do give your attention out, it's very valuable. You know what I'm saying? They was like, oh, wow. You know what I mean? Thank you from me is very different than thank you from me like back in the day. I would say thank you back in the day. They'd be like, fuck out of here, you bum ass motherfucker. You know what I mean? They would talk crazy. Now they'd be like, oh, wow. Wow. Oh, you shouldn't have. And I'm like, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Different type they value time. And that's all across the board. Women in my women in my family, women at my job, women at the gym, women outside. They value attention more. Because you don't give it that easily. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So that's what I have, man. I uh, hope you guys liked it. Let me know what you guys think. Let me know what your journey is, how you, your journey's been going. If you want to see more attention, if you on monk mode, let me see what you guys are doing. How's your journey has been going? Let's talk, man. Let's chat. Comment below. Subscribe. One, one, one out. Peace.